We're learning details of Mary Kay Letourneau's final days. Her estranged husband, Billy Falau, was at her side at the very end when she died of cancer at age 58. Billy came up and was by her side for the last couple of months. Uh, at the end, 24-7, taking care of her because he loved her. I had time to emotionally prepare for it. And it hurts. And I know it hurts him. A family statement declared, Mary passed away peacefully after a six-month battle. She fought tirelessly against this terrible disease. It was sad when she got the news. She was told then that it was stage four and fatal. She stayed strong. Mary Kay Letourneau became the poster child for teachers caught up in sex scandals involving their students. She was a married woman with four children when she had an affair with her student, who was then 12 years old. She was pregnant when she was sentenced to seven years in prison for child rape. It was wrong. And I am sorry. Over the years, Inside Edition has covered every twist and turn of the Letourneau saga, baby, baby. including the birth of her second child with Falau, a girl born behind bars. When Mary Kay was released from prison in 2004, she and Falau married. I now pronounce you husband and wife. <laughs> they were interviewed by Barbara Walters in 2015 on their 10th anniversary. There is a story of us that has a life of its own. They said a marriage born in scandal wouldn't last, and it didn't. They split in 2017. Their daughters are now in their 20s. Attorney Ann Bremner was Letourneau's friend. Do you think she ever regretted her actions with Vili Falau? Honestly, I don't think she did. I, I think that she felt that it was a love story, and she gave up a lot for love. Now the book is closed on the controversial life of Mary Kay Letourneau.